but uh, push down there. Don't do that, whatever you do. Hey everybody, Keith K here. And welcome back to the South Pacific. Uh, now that we had finished the end game, one of the things that uh, I wanted to play around with was kind of making my own aircraft carrier. So I'm just gonna show that off a little bit today. Uh, if you remember, if you saw my end game videos, um, two of the locations, uh, the eel and the squid were really far away uh, and the, the gyrocopter uses so much fuel uh, it was kind of it was definitely not worth it to try to fly all the way out there um, to see uh, you know if we could scout from the air but um, this seems to be working I, I extended my raft quite a bit so that I could land my gyrocopter here and the idea being that I could you know take my boat out to a, uh, a new location um, and the way I always build my rafts is, even though I rely on the motor the most part, I always have a sail so that I can get back around and then be able to take the gyrocopter off the boat and do a quick scan of the area. Um, you know, in this case, this is actually my first island. I think that's the island that we started on. And then, you know, we could go scout a couple of other islands um, and not quite run out of fuel. The gyrocopter is kind of full right now so we could go to a new location scout a few different islands and then come back to the raft and use the raft to go to another location you know further out on the map um, and and be sure that as long as we didn't run out of fuel mid-flight as long as we were getting back to our raft uh, that we could always get back to our base because we could go back to sail power in the worst case Right, so uh, we'll take a quick peek at this island here, for example. And then uh, we'll go ahead and head back and land on our uh, gyrocopter carrier. So this isn't really a tutorial as much as I wanted to kind of show off uh, an idea that uh, maybe you'll find useful. It's, uh, it's basically just building, you know, a bigger raft. The raft seems to go a little bit slower, you know, so we can assume we explored that fully. But uh, the, the raft does seem to go a little bit slower. Um, but at the end of the day, it, it does move. Um, it doesn't sink. Like when you put, I don't know, even just one corrugated steel on there, um, you know, or you put a barrel or two, the raft kind of goes underwater. It's, it's a bit of a pain in the butt. Um, you know, but this seems to work out fine. So we'll come back and uh, we'll land on the aircraft carrier and get underway. All right, there's our raft, our, our gyrocopter carrier. Um, I'm just gonna try to come in here on approach and just line up a little bit. You definitely don't wanna fall off of the raft. That is one hazard uh, that will cause problems for you, especially if there's a shark nearby. But it's not too hard to land, as you can see. Um, that propeller really should be getting tripped up by the sail, but it doesn't, you know, you could theoretical, theoretically make this a little bit longer, but um, it works out pretty well, not bad at all. We could be on our way off to the next set of islands or um, off to, uh, you know, our back to our home base. Pretty much that's gonna do it for this video, short and sweet, just an idea I wanted to share with you all. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, leave a like if you did, consider subscribing, and I'll see you back here soon. Thanks, everybody.